biggest camel toe. Ah! <laughs> this meeting got called yesterday, so gonna be a big one. Very, very, very exciting. Clean Treat's journey is not over. It's crazy. Every year we're like, this is our biggest year. Yeah, this is, we've got this going on. And every year it just, it just explodes even more. And we're like, oh my God. Good morning guys and welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a vlog. So I'm gonna take you kind of like a day in the life and show you some of the things that I get up to. I have made a smoothie bowl. Basically got banana, truck greens powder, splash of almond milk, muesli on top, chia seeds. What else do I have in there? A bit of coffee actually. I'm feeling really tired today. I'm still having to sleep kind of on my back, not on my side or not on my tummy. So I just, I get broken sleep because when I wake up, I'm like, oh, don't roll to the side. And it's just, I don't know, just still not feeling super comfortable but anyways a day in the life of ashy binds let's get started Bang! good morning are you sore sore i slept in dropped my phone are we in a cranky mood or are we in a happy mood we're happy just not the best start to the morning no, that's okay well right, you look cute yeah big day ahead it's gonna be really good what do we have on give us the rundown i'm filming this morning and then we're gonna go into the office for a company meeting with everyone which is like how many of us like 30. it's a lot yeah like there's some people in there i was like <laughs> oh my god but i was like oh my god there's so many of us and i missed out on the photo shoot with Grady rose today which sucks oh. Well, I've still got the tape on from my surgery and then because we've got this massive meeting today with the whole company I think if Ashy Bynes wasn't at the Ashy Bynes meeting, it'd be a little bit awkward So <laughs> Gritty was like, I'm so sad you're not coming because of your tape I said yeah, but I probably would have had to cancel on you anyway because this meeting got called yesterday So gonna be a big one. So I'm gonna take you guys a little bit behind the scenes Obviously, I won't be able to sh like film the whole meeting But um, I'll introduce you to a couple of our team members and show you around the office Although our office is gonna be getting renovated next year so it doesn't look very pretty at the moment, but the plans for next year, that'll be an amazing vlog to be able to show you guys. Do you think you should show them um, <laughs> Oh God. Oh my God. Wow, well, I'm gonna zoom right on in. It just looks like bush. That's our veggie garden down there. Yep. It's nearly time for us to head off to our meeting. We're gonna make some, oh, I'm so pasty. I mean, I get a proper spray tan. I've done a little bit of mousse a couple of days ago. I need like full tan. Anyway, it's gonna make some clean treats to take to all of our team. What flavor are we gonna make? Caramel almond dough. What about Greg Lamington? Lamington, I'm obsessed with at the moment. But by the time this vlog's up, you guys won't be able to purchase them anymore, but we have so many exciting things happening next year. Clean Treats journey is not over. We're just kind of mixing things up a bit and adding in something really exciting. I just can't give away too much, but stay tuned. But don't get sad because it's not over. It's gonna be even better next year. I can't wait to announce to all of you. We are also just whipping up some lunch before we go so we know we'll get starving in the meeting. So we've just got some sweet potatoes, some organic chicken, zucchini, capsicum and onion and broccolini and we're just gonna chuck it all in the pan with some coconut aminos and coconut oil and it's just like a big chicken veggie stir fry. Nice and easy. You know how you have plastic breadboards and you have wooden breadboards? True. What's better to cut meat on? Plastic or wood? I, I would think plastic. This wood's porous, so you, it, the meat could soak in. Yes, that is true. However, the meat also stays. Why are you talking like this? Because <laughs> I'm giving you a bath. Get it out, get it out. So the meat <laughs> that goes onto the wood that seeps in, then goes to the middle and dies. But isn't on the meat already dead? The germs die. <laughs> but on the plastic, it gets stuck in the grooves and you can never Get rid of it. There you go. Useless fact of the day. Brought Don't, to you by Matt. Not digging it? Mm, it's pretty common sense, I thought. <laughs> going to the office, babe. Okay, I'll see you soon. You know the rules. Mm, what's uh, our rules? Have to kiss before we leave because uh, we never know what's going to happen, so you don't want to leave without getting, getting a kiss. Mm, I love you. See you in 10 minutes. <laughs> Anyways, so we've just finished our lunch. Looks delish. So now I'm just going to dish it up into containers, so in our meeting we are stocked. Standard mum life, nappies and wipes all up in my car. 
Got our clean treats for the team. Ready to go? Oh, oh sore. She did a massive gym session yesterday with Nick. You are one sore little kitten, aren't you? So sore. <laughs> Oh, Will I be editing this vlog? You will be editing this vlog. So I could even take this part Best out. Best editor. Mm -hmm. No, you're not taking good. it out. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Woo! Mm -hmm. What do you think, Actually, Taylor, Taylor. Nice to meet you. Hello. Working with Jess. Clean yeah, tree. I do. I thought I'd bought it bring in some supplies for everyone. Very nice. For our big Very meeting. Nice. All right, I'll see you down there. Right. So this office looks pretty ugh, and boring at the moment. We haven't been in here that long, but we now have hired an interior designer and it's all gonna be renovated and looks beautiful, the plans that she's got. This used to be Sammy's little breeze mum office, but she's now moved out. She spread her wings and float away. This is Steve's office that he never uses. <laughs> he works at home, so it's kind of a waste of space and screens. And it was crucial to get those screens it was put together. And this is our big board meeting room. This wall we can actually draw on and wipe all off. It's our big whiteboard, which is really cool. And then around here is where all the editors and videographers work their magic. Hello. It's Chelsea so Lowe. clean here. Yeah, hello. So massive now. So. And then in here is a little room that we film a lot of stuff. All of our marketing, marketing and ads and everything that you might see pop up on Facebook it gets all done in here. Yeah, that's pretty much it. What's that? Don't don't film oh, yeah. you. You look stunning. <laughs> Just had a skin peel, so. Oh, nice. Apparently not allowed to put makeup on after. Here's hey, the crew. Guys. Hi, Beck. Hello. You went on my blog before. Oh. Your skin off. Yeah. <laughs> Good. 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 <laughs> Hello, Nay. Hello. Hello. Hey. Good. Thank you. Just sort of Good. pop you on the vlog. Don't want to leave anyone out, you know. <laughs> Trace. Hello. How are you? I'm well, babe. How are you? What are we drinking? <laughs> um, milk coffee. Oh, that looks horrible. <laughs> <laughs> We're rearranging everything. <laughs> we have caramel almond dough and mocha. <laughs> Big thanks for everyone to coming short notice. <laughs> Basically, I think the whole point of the meeting is to really plan out next year, especially quarter one, and almost run this business like a, a real business. Um, <laughs> This is exciting. <laughs> <laughs> so, pro yeah. so professional, aren't we? Just honest, we're raw. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we're very raw. Yeah. I'd say maybe, what, two years ago, a year and a half, we decided to put the best people in roles and not just try and cover everything ourselves, but find the best people, put them in the best role and let them go. And I think we've done that in a lot of areas. So that's been pretty successful. Guys. <laughs> Team meeting is done and dusted now. It's so good to catch up with the whole team and connect with everyone and just check in with everyone and see how everything's going. And yeah, I suppose just like we're really planning a massive 2018. There's so many exciting things going on. So it's really important for all of us to just make sure we're all on the same page and on top of everything. There's just, it's crazy. Every year we're like, this is our biggest year. Yeah, this is, we've got this going on. And every year it just, it just explodes even more. And we're like, oh my God. But it's all just so exciting, so positive. So much fun for all of you. Very, 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 very exciting. Wish I could tell you guys everything, but um, yeah, I'll keep you up to date as soon as I'm allowed to let out the beans of everything that we are doing, so stay tuned. All right, so we are back home from our staff meeting and I'm about to go live on my Facebook page. There's like three and a half million people not people on there, so that is just crazy. But I'm about to do a bit of a toned haul. So I always get asked to show my favorite combos and my favorite items, which is always really hard to choose. Obviously, because I love every single one of them, I would never put anything out there that I didn't personally just love to wear or love the fit and feel of it myself. But yes, I'm about to do that and one lucky winner is gonna win a free toned outfit. So me and Nat are about to do that. A bit of a behind the scenes. I am wearing the cute little knot crop and the gray earthy tights, which I just cannot get over. We go with everything. So as you can see over here, this is our lovely white wall. It's just the door to the man cave. So we're about to go live and- Do you want to put perfume on or? No, you don't need perfume. But I'm gonna be trying on different outfits and in between Nat's gonna hold the camera and talk about pricing and just some questions that might come through. And now she's freaking out because she heard me say there's three and a half million people. It's different when like I can talk back to you. Yeah, yeah. And it's gonna be like, get off the camera. And you get distracted because you're Boo! trying to- No, they like, won't. Because you're trying to like talk but then all their comments are coming up. All right. Hey, hello everyone. Welcome to a live chat with me. All right, guys. 
Most days, Nat and I receive samples at home and we always have to try them on. We have to check the stitching, we have to check the fabric, make sure they feel good, they look good. And we thought we would share a little behind the scenes of a sample that we got today. I love my booty shorts. So comfortable, so flattering. They just look so good on everyone. I love the fit, I love the material, I love it all. So I thought I'd try and choose a different fabric and a different fit for just more yoga, I suppose. This is what they look like. And I'm gonna go downstairs and show Steve and see what his reaction is because he's super, super honest. I wanna see his reaction with these shorts. Nat laughed when I put them on. They look okay like this. <laughs> They're like, oh my gosh, you're going super close. <laughs> the biggest camel toe to the point where I actually feel like you can see like yeah. the line, you know, the, the line. I was going to say something really bad. No, you can't say that. I know what you're going to say. And then you turn around and like cuts in your fat pack. It's just not... Not that you even have a fat pack, like... But like, it's it. created a fat pack. It just is not flattering around the one area I feel like most girls are really self-conscious about. So these are not going to production. Not happening. But let's go sit downstairs and show Steve and see what he says. Babe, I've got some shorts to show you. See what you think. I like them. They're so comfortable. Is it like the camel range? The what? The camel range. <laughs> <laughs> How bad is it? You can literally see like everything. Yeah. <laughs> Told you he's They're honest. like surgi <laughs> surgical shorts. We should call it, yeah, they are like surgical. We should call it the camel range. The camel range. Aren't camel toes in? So like 1980s. Oh my god, so no, no go for the camel range? Nah. Okay, the camel range is coming off. <laughs> you want these shorts, don't you? Oh my god. Love the camel toes. No, they're so bad. Oh my god. So we are home from daycare. Set, walk down. One. Oh, what is that? You got it. Come down here. He loves the camera, like literally playing with it. Come on. Yeah, come down here. Daddy. Hold my face. Good boy. Hey. <laughs> so, pretty much, choose. It is Daddy's car. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, he goes to daycare. We pick him up about four o'clock. We could just come home, hang. Nat's actually cooking us dinner tonight. Butter chicken. Come here. Wow. Then we're gonna have a bath soon. Have some dinner. It's impossible to vlog with him around because he always wants my camera. Mummies. Oh my God, I gotta turn this vlog off. So you're making us butter chicken tonight, Nat? Delicious. Copied it from Pete Evans. Well, now from the school project. Oh yes, a bit of inspiration from both though. Yeah. I'm excited. We've got some veggies in there. We're using cauliflower rice instead of normal rice. All our herbs and spices. Coconut milk. Oh, clean treats. Wow. Yeah, it's nearly dinner time and then bath time. Sometimes if he's really hungry, he'll go crazy like this. Oh, come here. Mummy. Mummy, I know. It's really tough being a toddler. It's a really tough life. Hey. You're so cute. Bye. Can you say bye? Bye. Good boy, say bye camera. Are you gonna do pee-pee in your potty? Mm. Yeah? No. Want me to show you how? Mm. Danny can't even squat down there. Ah. Can you do it? Ready? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Silly daddy, you hop in. You gonna take your pants off? <laughs> <laughs> what is that? He doesn't want to do it on YouTube, do you mate? No, I'll turn it off. Good morning everyone, it is the next day, so I thought I would do a little bit of vlogging today, what we get up to. It is Friday, can you say Friday Taj? Friday, which means Taj does not go to daycare, so he's tagging along with us today. We're gonna go see Mammy's new house. I'm the way to go. Yay! Oh. This is Mammy's new house. Where's Mammy? Hello, Taj. Can you give Mammy a big kiss? Hold Mammy's face. Hold her face. Oh, it's your new, new, your new yard. You get to play out here. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, we better leave that. Bye, Say bye, little mower. Bye, little mower. Bye. 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 Bye.
Go <laughs> 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 show daddy. Hey daddy. This is what you sound like. The fart machine, daddy. Show oh. daddy. Is that what daddy sounds like? Yeah. Show daddy the fart machine. Push it. Banana. I'm gonna wrap up this vlog with my three favorite smoothies, so let's get started. So the first one is a dark salted caramel, and it's also got coffee. Oh, are you hungry? Also got. He's very hungry. <laughs> it's also got a hint of coffee in there, so the coffee is actually optional. But in the morning, if I feel like I've got a massive day and I'm just a bit tired, I do like coffee in there. And this one is just from Coles. It's like three dollars, and it's got a hint of caramel in there. So I find the flavor is just really beautiful. So what we're going to do is start with just a cup of water. Now coconut milk is really nice in this as well, but I'm adding almond butter, so I find I get my healthy fats from that. So I'm just going to use normal water. Almond milk, coconut milk, or water. It all works really nicely, and I've tried it with all three of them, and they all are still really delicious. So it doesn't really matter what you use. One cup of water. If you've been following me for a while, you would know that I do have a Thermomix, but I just don't rate it. And for smoothies especially, I find it just doesn't blend up super smooth like Nutribullet does. I saw a lot of girls in my worldwide squad forum using Nutribullet, so I decided to get one, and it's so, so good. Blends it up so nice and smooth. So I'm going to go one teaspoon of almond butter. I think almond butter is the secret ingredient to making anything caramel just taste so good. I find it much better than dates. I think it gives such a nice smooth caramel taste. You got a handful of frozen banana. Now you can use a normal banana. I just find frozen is really nice and thick and creamy and it makes it nice and cold as well. We've got a teaspoon of chopped greens powder. Anywhere that you can get greens powder into your system is amazing. This obviously is chocolate flavor, so it's so yummy. And then we're gonna go the Happy Way Salted Caramel Protein Powder. The vanilla also works really nice, but this one I am trying to get that real caramel flavor, so obviously we'll go with the salted caramel. I do have a discount code for the Happy Way as well. I'll put it in the description box below, and I'll put the link to the chopped greens powder as well. Blend it up. Delicious chalk salted caramel. Did I put the coffee in? Oh my god, I've got to put the coffee in. Hang on, guys. Hang on, take two. It doesn't taste the same. I didn't think it looked the right color actually. Teaspoon of my coffee. Take two. Delish. Chalk coffee salted caramel. Mm. How to one of my favorite smoothies to date. I'm gonna put that aside and get the ingredients for smoothie number two. All right, so now we are on to smoothie number two. This is my go-to post-workout smoothie. It's really simple, really hydrating. It's full of protein. It also has some carbohydrates just to refuel your body and get you started for the day and start repairing your muscles. This is the very, very first protein smoothie that I ever tried. When I first met Stephen, he introduced me to just a healthier lifestyle in general, and he made me my first breakfast smoothie. This was it. So I've kind of always had it, always enjoyed it, and it's just really easy to make. So all you need is your choice of berries. Today I'm going to use strawberries, you can use mixed berries or blueberries or whatever floats your boat. I'm going to use the vegan vanilla happy weight, it actually tastes so good, I find it really hard to find vegan protein powders that taste really nice with the vanilla flavour. They have nailed just rolled oats, I'm going to use two tablespoons and I have coconut water today. You can use normal water, it will still taste amazing, just coconut water is full of electrolytes so it's really hydrating. Cup of coconut water, two tablespoons of oats. Give us some nice carbs. So one full scoop of the Happy Way, which is one full serving. Oh, actually smells so good. Vegan protein powder, a lot of the time, it's just really like gritty and dirty tasty in your teeth, but this one's not. Just a handful of strawberries, guys. <laughs> Load up the strawberries. Remember, this is post-workout, so it's your best time to have any sugars and carbs. And strawberries are actually one of the fruits that are really low in sugars as well, so you can really load it up and make it super sweet. Yeah, so this one is a little bit thick. I should have probably added a little bit more liquid, but that's okay. Beautiful. It's like a frozen healthy slushy. Cheers. Mm, I make I like that better with strawberries and blueberries actually. That is good. Alright, on to smoothie number three. Smoothie number three, this is just my go-to basic green smoothie. Once again, super easy. If anyone is time poor, 
and trying to get loads of nutrients into your body, especially if you've got kids, this is the easiest way to do it. And you can make it so versatile and so yummy by adding in what you like and figuring out what you do like. But this is my two green smoothies. What you need is some spinach, fresh spinach. I find kale in smoothies is quite, it's almost a bit too strong, whereas spinach you can't really taste. Banana is gonna be, gonna be our sweetener. So once again, it makes it nice and thick and creamy. And then we're gonna add our greens powder. I use the More Life brand. I like the pineapple and coconut in smoothies, but if I'm just having it by itself, I'll have the acai raspberry. Not really a fan of the lemon and the lime anymore. I find after having these two flavors, the lemon and lime just isn't sweet enough for me because greens powder can be quite horrid, but those two flavors are amazing. And they're just the standard Happy Way vanilla protein powder because it is just the nicest tasting protein powder you will ever, ever try. It tastes like vanilla ice cream. Oh, and a cup of water. Once again, you can use almond milk, coconut milk, coconut water, whatever you like. I'm just gonna use normal water today. So one cup of water, nice generous handful of spinach, teaspoon or a tablespoon of the greens powder. I've been having this for ages, so I can tolerate quite a lot of it, and I like it. So I'm gonna go a lot. A nice generous handful of banana, a little bit more, and a scoop of my Happy Way vanilla. If you guys haven't watched my um, pantry makeover video, I should link, I'll link it above or in the description um, box. You guys should go check it out. I've put everything into containers and it just looks so much prettier in my pantry. It almost motivates me to eat healthier. So go and check that out. It's much better than all the big plastic comes in. All right, blend away. Last but not least, delicious, easy green smoothie. Nice and smooth, really vibrant, pretty color. Yum. So if you enjoyed this type of video and you would love more food and smoothie ideas, definitely let me know below in the comments. I've got so many yummy smoothies up my sleeve, but I didn't want to overload you guys. So they are my top three, my top go-tos that I find I make the most. There's a couple of ones that I make from Taj, that I make for Taj. I might put in a separate video as well. But I hope you enjoyed the day in the life, couple of meals, smoothies. If you did, give a big thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.